my channel guys it's your girl coco styles and in today's video i'm gonna be doing a quick unboxing so i just opened the box and i'm not gonna take the hat out just yet um i did purchase a lack of color hat that's been on my my little wish list for some time now i was kind of hesitant because it is a little pricey however um there's some things on the hat that i love that i have not been seeing at other places when I buy a hat. Um, there is some sort of dupe out there from, I believe it's Urban Outfitters, but it doesn't have that extra rim on it. So I'm just gonna take it out the box. And the box comes like this. One thing I do like about it is that they did have fragile on the box, which is so awesome because that means they handle it with care. So it comes inside this bag right here, which is like a Ziploc bag, and you just un you unzip it or whatever to um, get it open. And I got the Rancher, sorry guys. I got the Rancher, the Ivory Rancher hat in a 59 centimeter, which is equivalent to a large. Now, if you are a person who wears units and stuff, or if you have natural hair that's big and curly, um, I probably would recommend a large, but let's see how it is when I try it on, because this that I have on my head has a lot of hair. And I only wear it when I just don't really feel like doing my natural hair. So let's try it on, but here's the hat, guys. It is gorgeous. It's, it says ivory. But this is more of a cream, creamish color to me. More of a cream. It's not as light as it's saying. I am going to get another one. This is a darker brown one. But I wanted to start with this one because I feel like it'll go with more of my stuff in my closet. So here it is. It does have the place for the hat filler. And you can buy that separate. I believe it's like $5. But... Um, again, it does have lack of color on the inside. Um, and what else does it say here? Um, it's designed in Australia. It does have all of its, like, you know, social media and stuff like that. It's 100% Australian wood. Sorry, not wood, wool. <laughs> and they say they recommend you spot clean it. So, I would say... Try your best to keep it uh, as neat, as clean as possible because it is rather light. But here's the hat, guys. Ooh, yes. This hat is gorgeous. I hope you guys can really, really see what it looks like. Um, like the full color and stuff. Let me just bend my head down so you guys can see that. Um, I'm probably going to insert some pictures too once I link it in the description box for you guys. But I would probably wear it like this. I will say this is a large. And like I said, this unit has a lot of hair in it. So I'm able to stick two fingers under here. So I would probably recommend just getting the hat filler. I think it's like $5 just so you can have it. Um, if I don't wear my unit, my head is not that large. So what'll probably happen is it'll probably feel big so I can just put the hat filler. So you could wear it like that or you can wear it towards the back like that. And I think both ways are actually really, really cute. This hat is awesome, guys. I recommend it. And one thing that I really do love about it is that it has the extra uh material around the brim so it doesn't flop like some of the other hats and that was my biggest concern um i do have this bcbg hat i'll probably do like some sort of hat haul or something and i like that one because it's wool at the top but the whole brim is really big it has it's leather i bought that hat like oh my god like four years ago never wore because it it's so dramatic but the way i've been feeling these days I'm feeling a little extra. So, I don't know. I just wanted to give you guys a quick unboxing and give you guys my initial review of the hat and what I actually think about it. I absolutely love it. I think it's worth the money. 
especially for this extra um, piece around the brim. Um, if I found a dupe that has this, that's good quality, that's 100% wool, I would probably purchase that too. But since I had it, this was the way that I was going to go and that's it. But I will tell you guys, look for a coupon before you purchase it. I was able to find a coupon by some, I don't even know where. I just Googled a coupon because the hat is $129 originally, but with taxes and stuff, who knows? All I know is that I paid $119 <laughs> flat. So once I applied the 20% coupon, it took off $20 and... I don't think they, oh, they didn't charge me tax. There's no tax here. It's just my shipping. So after the 20% off, it came up to 109 And then the shipping was $10. Came up to 119 I think it's a steal. So, yeah. Instead of like 140 guys, hey, I'm just saying that. Actually, a little $20. Um... You know, and then it comes with like a thank you card. Thank you for your LOC purchase. Um, when I see LOC, because I work in healthcare, I'm thinking of level of care, <laughs> but lack of color. Uh, and it tells you that it's made in Australia and stuff. So I don't know. I would recommend you guys getting it. If you are a fabulous lady, lady and you like hats, I would recommend getting this. Now, I'm not going to say buy every single lack of color hat because it will add up in price. But I say have a nice little, you know, different variety of hats from different places and stuff like that. I, where I live in Atlanta, we do have a place in um, a market out here that, that's a huge hat store. Really nice hats. And, um, you know, if you have something like that, I would say try that. But in the meantime, between time, you should get this hat. So anyway, thank you guys for tuning in for this quick unboxing. Um, if you like videos like this, comment below and, you know, I'll let you guys see the hats that I do have um, and hats that I do recommend for women. I don't know if men can, oh, you know what? This may be a unisex hat. I'm going to double check because I, I could have sworn on the website there was a man wearing the same hat. So it's probably a unisex hat. <laughs> I don't know. But um, if you guys stay to the end of this video, I really appreciate it if you comment below. Coco, we see you. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.